David Wong has appeared in nine films, including Project Gutenberg with Hong Kong star Cho Yun Fat and 53 television shows like Junior Parents and To Be a Better Man. I talked to him about what keeps him going and why he's always inspired to cross boundaries. Wong has published his first book during the ongoing Shanghai Book Fair. And the book collects conversations with nine people, including renowned director Edward Lam and painter Shinzo Tashima. He believes finding a way to experience different lives is the key to his acting career. Well, good to have you again, David. Well, thank you. First of all, congratulations mm -hmm. to the publishing of your new book. Well, thank you. Um, we know that you spent three years, yes. talked to nine outstanding artists, um, put it all into a, a program, and mm -hmm. then finally this book. So why, why did you do that? Actually, I asked 14 masters in their business and we put nine artists into this book because mm -hmm. uh, since mm, I'm an actor, so uh, this is something related to me. I think I'm a lucky one because my job is actually my interest. I I'm very happy to have this job that I, you know, I just spending all my time to try to be a better actor. And uh, after decades, I just want to know if other people have the same feeling with me. So um, I start to asking this kind of question. I wanted to interview people and I want to share their uh, wisdom of life to the audience. Since you're an actor, you have to, you know, you have to have experience. You have to see different things to have, to have different feelings. Yeah. And to memorize and exercise it. You've done a lot of cross-boundary uh, performing arts yeah. projects like yeah. with Sylvia Chang you did while we chat mm. and also Pierre Jint with yes. the Shanghai Symphony Orchestra. Yes. So why do you always do cross-boundary projects? Do you think it's more challenging? It means a lot to me that doing something fun. Take Pierre Jint for example. There are really seldom people who can stand in front of the symphony orchestra and enjoy the whole musical. Yeah, I'm the lucky one. It's the first time I standing in the middle of the, the orchestra and the music just came from everywhere. You know, I just couldn't enjoy it more. Cross the boundary means that you can always to the, to challenge something new, and you will see well different level. You, you can you can meet different people, and you can always you get fresh. To me, it seems like a person who always break your comfort zone. So, what is your comfort zone? Why do you always want to expand it? There's a guy say that uh, stay in comfort zone that kills you from progressing. Yeah, and I was, I think that's, I think he's right. Yeah, so I just took a role that I was n probably I will never take. It has the special makeup on me, mm -hmm. so I will become literally a ghost. It's tiresome because you have to spend four and a half an hours for, makeup. for makeups. Yeah, and spend another two hours to remove it. It turns out like this. Oh, that's you? That's me. For most actors, they want people to know it's me and I have yeah. amazing skills of acting, but I need you to know it's my face, it's me. I can, I can you know, act different characters. Yeah. But from that, th no one would ever guess that's actually you. But that's something I've, I've never done before. When I watch it, I'll be the only one who, kno <laughs> who, who know. that's actually David. <laughs> All right, thank you very much, David, for your time. It's well, always you. a pleasure talking to you. Yeah. I'm looking forward to your next um, wonderful work. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you so much. Thank you. Thank you.